Hi everyone, I am Amy Shin Chia, Microsoft MVP. Welcome to my video. From a previous video, I shared about Microsoft Box Framework and also in Cognitive Services Emotion API that integrate with the Microsoft Box Framework. Today, I would like to share with you about Cognitive Services Computer Vision APIs. Who am I? Microsoft MVP, speaker in different conference community and events. And I'm also a trainer for a workshop. Second, I am Microsoft Certified Professional with the MCSA Cloud Platform, MCSE Cloud Platform and Infrastructure. Lastly, I am also a co-organizer of Malaysia Mobile.net developer group that uh, and I'm currently in uh, Singapore but I try to two months or three months want to host a event in Malaysia for my local user group for today objective help you to understand cognitive services API offer quick and easy AI function without de developing machine learning model that you can use within your app from today for free for the goals I encourage you to build out the new AI empower apps and services in short terms for today's requirement you need to have a Microsoft account, Microsoft Azure account if you does not have Microsoft Azure account, you can activate via Visual Studio Dev Essential. But I will show you in uh, my last slide. Then you can go to the link to activate your Microsoft Azure. Lastly, it's a Visual Studio 2017 examining. Because today demo, I will use the mobile the mobile application developed by using Jamie. Okay, for today agenda, <coughs> I will sh show you the continuous services computer vision APIs. Then second demo. The lastly is a reference and tutorial for computer vision. Computer Vision API is for in a uh, vision category in a cognitive services. What is Computer Vision API? Computer Vision API is one of several APIs available in Microsoft Cognitive Services and it can recognize object in photos, caption, caption photo, extract from image and more. Backend by using machine learning, it enable a wide range of software scenario, including websites that filter out image with adult content and apps that allow photo to be shared using computer generator keyword. For example, like um, if you are underage, uh, if your kids is underage. Then you can set your lab, uh, set your website. Uh, that's not, you can set the searching engine that does not allow to, to avoid your kids to shop for any other content web, uh, website or any of the adult content image show to your kids. Okay, let's go for demo computer vision API. First, then here first, you go to a computer vision model to write out the computer vision models. Uh, okay, sorry, sorry. And um, okay, for today application, I am using the MVVM method to write the mobile application 
Okay, second. We go to manage NuGet. Right click the friend folder. Manage NuGet packages. A few uh, new a few new gets I we need to install. The the first one and second one Microsoft BCL. You need to add Microsoft BCL and Microsoft BCL build package to all layers from new get in order to be able to use the services. The next one is a uh, Microsoft.NET HTTP and also the new generation to get the uh, return data. The lastly, we need to install the plugin media from a new get to analyze the photo without this plugin. You cannot recognize the photo where is it. Okay, at first, as I mentioned before, I, I am using the application by using the MVVM. Then, after that, we go to the service manager.cs. Here, we need to write a service manager class so that we can request the service from the uh, computer vision API. Lastly, we need to go to Microsoft Azure Microsoft Azure portal. Okay, let's go to Microsoft Azure portal. How you find it? Okay, add new. Then we search for computer vision API. Then it will explain to you what can computer vision API can implement services that you can implement in your mobile application. Then after that, click create. I close this uh, because I already create the computer computer vision API. Then I go back to my resource group. Then I already put in a resource group. Okay, after that, in our resource group, you saw your con uh, computer vision. Then you can fit get the key from here. Grab your key. Then after that, you paste the key inside line 24 in a service manager.cs. Okay, after that, Maybe after that you can deploy in your uh, in the emulator. But for today demo, I will show you I uh, in the in my mobile application in my mobile. Okay, here unlock it. Then I go to the my. The application I already deployed in my phone and select this one. Okay, once you can take a photo or select a photo, but I will show you select a photo. And I go to my album, reason, and this one. Okay, this is some time to, to analyze the photo. Okay, from the photo, it show a move in the snow. Then it will realize that that animal move members outdoor snow. Then I show you another one. So that a photo, album, a spy chair. Yeah, it show you the Red leather chair. I try to take a photo.
and let's see I'm not sure whether this one turn or not okay I already take uh, one photo that analyze that a bottle of water on the table we yeah, are type of indoor bottle table tables sitting yeah it's really nice application if you want to customize it uh, from the source code I will show you later when to get the source code okay that's all for mobile the application demo <coughs> the blog article will be coming soon because currently in the holiday season you can refer to my blog okay for if you want to learn more you can go to my slide share about the uh, cognitive services and what framework you can also go to my sub, follow my twitter sub, please subscribe my youtube if you want to see more about the uh, topic about microsoft technology please subscribe and comment in the video below if you have any feedback of about this video or question about this video please let me know and also comment in the video below and last you can activate your Microsoft Azure account in a Visual Studio that is essential please start now by using the Visual Studio Dev Essential Benefit. You can explore more about this. That's all for today. Thank you very much about your time. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.